Lizzie here. Thank you so much for tuning in today. Today is another product review day and I know I've been doing a lot of product reviews lately but I'm really really excited to share this one with you because it's a product that I absolutely love and I'm definitely going to be adding to my beauty must-haves list and I know I'm filming somewhere totally different today. I'm always filming somewhere different. I'm actually in our bedroom and I just kind of had to make a spot because my fiance is actually out in the living room where I usually film and he's taking up all the space plus he is playing music really loud and nobody wants to hear that. So yeah. So today's product review is on the Sun Goddess Sunless Tanning Lotion and this one is in dark. Now I've been looking for a good sunless tanning lotion for quite some time. I actually used to always go to the tanning bed and sometimes I still kind of want to go to the tanning bed. I don't know what it is. It's something about the lights or something. I love going to the tanning bed, but it's really not, you know, healthy for me. Every time I would go, I would notice like I had a new mole somewhere on my skin and frankly, you know, I was always getting like burnt and then I would kind of be tan for like a couple days and then I wouldn't be tan anymore and it was just like a real pain in the boudet. So I was like, you know what, I'm going to try out some sunless tanning and I was really, really hesitant about trying sunless tanning lotion because I've actually tried it in the past. I tried it previously and I used the Banana Boat sunless tanning lotion and I have to tell you guys, I really didn't like it. Uh, for one, it didn't last very long at all. It probably only lasted about two or three days. And when it started coming off, I could tell because it was these huge patches that of color that were like missing off my skin. And I looked like I had a disease and it really, really was bad. So I really didn't want to go there again. But I started doing some research online and I was looking for like the best sunless tanning lotion I could possibly try. And I came across Sun Goddess and I watched some of the reviews and stuff like that and I was you know pretty impressed with the results that a lot of people had so I thought you know what why not and I was actually sent this bottle by Sun Goddess to try out and so I was super excited to try it out because you know I was thinking you know maybe this is gonna come out really really good I'm gonna end up liking it a lot and I was very pleasantly surprised it's actually one of the best sunless tanning lotions I have ever used so they sent me this bottle and it is the 8 fluid ounce bottle and I love the bottle. Uh, you can't really tell on camera but the yellow decoration on the bottle is kind of like a glittery kind of um, color. You just can't really tell on camera and it does have a pump which is really really nice because you can just pump it right out into your hand. You don't have to squeeze and all that stuff and get stuff everywhere. And then the back of the bottle is also very nicely packaged again kind of with the glittery you know kind of decoration it gives you some instructions on there and it's also animal cruelty free which is super nice because I don't like it when people hurt the animals so this is really really nice um, love the bottle they also sent me in the package a little like uh, brochure I guess you could say kind of tells you about Sun Goddess it gives you the prices in there so yeah, you can see the different prices and then on the back if you go to like their Facebook page you could win this nifty little jersey shirt from Sun Goddess. I also got included on there, um, and I don't know how many this is, it looks like maybe about 10 of the Sun Goddess Dark Tanning Lotion samples and I was actually thinking about doing a giveaway and giving these away as like a prize you know for somebody else to try out out there because I do like to share and I do believe they sent these to me to share with others so I was thinking about kind of doing a really cute uh, giveaway with this so if you guys are interested in that I will definitely do that so um, I probably don't look very tan right now it's the lighting in the room for one and for two it's been about about a week now since I've actually applied this. I have showered every single day and I mean I still have a little bit of color. I'm definitely not pale or anything but I definitely am not as tan as I was at the beginning of the week when I did first put this on. So I'm going to tell you guys first of all a little bit about how I put it on, you know, um, the process, how I, you know, went through that 
and I'm going to give you the pros and cons of the product. And if you stay tuned to the end of the video, I'm going to give you guys a code when you go to order and it will save you 10% on your order. So that's huge. That's really, really wonderful. Um, so when I went to um, use the Sun Goddess Sunless Tanning Lotion, I first took a shower. I made sure to exfoliate with the loofah really, really good. And, you know, I also put on lotion on all the dry spots of my body. So I put it on my elbows, uh, my feet, my knees, and, you know, any part of your body that is, like, really, really dry, especially if you have, like, dry patches or something like that, you want to put lotion on that first so that it doesn't, like, soak up all of the sunless tanning lotion and then you'll get, like, those dark patches on your knees and feet and heels and ankles and things like that. So that really is a great tip that will help you avoid that whole, you know, fiasco. And it probably took me about 30 minutes to put on the sunless tanning lotion after I exfoliated and everything. It does come with applicator gloves. I've used mine. Um, they're really just like black latex gloves. So if you use those and you want to throw them away, you can always just use some like latex gloves. It's the same thing. And I just, you know, applied it real evenly, um, probably about one, you know, squirt per, like, area of your body and everything. And it took, yeah, about 30 minutes. And I have to tell you, this is the one best thing about the whole process was that the Sun Goddess Sunless Tanning Lotion does not have a bad smell at all. It actually smells really good. It kind of has, like, a tropical floral kind of smell. I don't know, but it smells really, really good, and I absolutely loved it. didn't have that fake tan smell, which is really gross. Um, yeah, so, you know, you do smell a little bit of, like, a kind of, like, a fake tan smell, like, maybe the day after you apply it, but it's very, very light, barely noticeable, and once you shower, you can't smell at all, so, yeah. Um, now, the next day after I showered, after applying the sunless tanning lotion, a lot of it did kind of wash off, but they do tell you that on the bottle that it is going to kind of come off. Now, when I say washed off, I mean like some of the extra, I guess, that hadn't soaked onto the skin had rinsed off, and it actually looked a lot more natural. It didn't look orange or anything. It looked really just like a natural tan, and it was very even. It evened out very nicely after I washed in the shower. They tell you that you can shower three hours after you apply this. However, I recommend doing it at night and just kind of going, you know, through the whole night and then part of the day and then like maybe after you get home from work, you know, taking a shower then. And I think that really helps to kind of soak in a whole lot better. Uh, as far as my experience goes, I believe that this sunless tanning lotion lasts probably about a week, um, but I'd say after about four days is when you really start noticing that it kind of is like fading. And the one good thing I want to say about it is that when it does start fading away, you definitely don't get the patchiness, you don't get like the patches of color that are missing or anything. It just fades away really nicely, really evenly. Um, so the pros of the product, I would have to say, I do love their packaging. I do love that there's a pump attachment here. It makes it so much easier to put on. The color is great. It doesn't look orangey. It looks like a natural tan. It doesn't have a bad smell. It's easy to apply. It applies evenly. It doesn't look splotchy or anything like that. And when it fades, it does fade away like evenly and nicely and not in like big huge patches or anything like that. So I have to say it is one of the best sunless tanning lotions that I've used. Um, as far as cons about the product, really there isn't a whole lot for me. Um, I'd have to say maybe just one of the cons is that it is a little bit pricey, um, but then again, I mean for the quality. Um, the bottle this size is $38.95, but you can always put in a 10% off code that I will give you, or it even says on here you can use use code free sample to get 10% off so either way um, you know you can save 10% and that will take quite a bit off of that price um, the other con is possibly that the day after you apply you may have a little bit of like a sunless tanning lotion smell but like I said it's very very light you can barely notice it and once you shower and kind of rinse off all that extra it actually doesn't smell like anything at all and you just smell like yourself. I love the Sunless Tang Lotion. It's the best one I've ever used. Um, I 
did include some before and after pictures in the beginning for you guys, so if you want to go back and look at that again, you're more than welcome to. I just absolutely loved it, and I really, really recommend it for anybody that's, you know, trying to quit going to the tanning bed, you want to save some money, and even at $38, you know, this bottle, I mean, I barely used any of this. I probably used, like, this much of the bottle to my whole body. So this will probably last me a good few months. Tanning boutiques, you pay, like, $40 a month to go tanning anyway, and this is going to last you, like, a couple months, if not more, if you don't, like, use it all the time. So really, it's really worth the money, and it's a lot more affordable than going to the tanning bed. So I really hope that you guys found this review helpful. I do hope you'll try it out. And if you are interested in ordering, when you go to the sungoddess.com website, just enter the promo code LittleMissSusieQ02, just like my YouTube username, and it will save you 10% on your order, which is huge. So, you know, that's a good way for you to save some money. But I really, really recommend this. It's like my summer must have because I hate being pale and I really want to thank Sun Goddess for sending this to me so thank you all so much for watching I hope you found this review helpful if you have any um, tips tricks about sunless tanning or any questions feel free to leave them in the comments below and thank you so much you guys for watching thank you Sun Goddess for letting me try out this great product I absolutely love it and I'll catch you guys in the next video